good morning nice early one today all right so it's 5 15 new south wales time so 4 15 here in queensland and i'm gonna go do uh devil's thumb okay and it's just about 10 15 minutes north of mossman a little bit hard to find but here yeah, I'm ready to go look at Devil's Thumb. Wish me luck. Ten and a half Ks in and out. Alright, re return trip. Alright, give me luck. I'm an hour in, or oh, right up. Almost two. It's five, 558, may as well say six. I left at about quarter past four, so man, this is a trek, this is hard tour. Much harder than I was anticipating. Um, as you can see, the sun's rising now slowly coming up i'm not sure how far i am in um, but i'm just going to keep going it's getting very very steep so i'm assuming i'm getting closer yeah i'll let you know when i get there Nice little change of scenery here and under the bush it's just this nice looking shrubbery. Massive boulders. Just this insane, insane view. Made it. Devil's Farm. Two hours and 34 minutes. Massive trekking. That was hectic. That was so hard. Um, but we'll see whether or not it was worth it. Check it out with me. So there's a staircase. <laughs> the only bit of uh, human life on this track other than the track itself. Man-made stairs up to Devil's Thumb. Odd. All this way in. and straps great reveal let's wait until we get up to the very top We made it. <laughs> Holy fuck. Holy shit, man. <sighs> Holy shit. Absolutely insane. Absolutely insane, like words don't even describe it. Just can't describe how picturesque this is. Um, so it took me a total of about four, 
10 a.m. Started hiking at 4.15. Uh, it's now 7.45. I've been here for about 10 minutes, so it took me about three and a half hours to get to Summit or to the Devil's Farm. But it was by far the most disorientating track I've walked. Um, no real markers, just a few pink tags every few meters between trees and some had been ripped down and, and torn off. Um, the track was extremely overgrown, extremely overgrown. I, I mean, it was up past my shoulder at points, so extremely disorientating. Um, very challenging, very, very challenging, especially those first three Ks, they were tough. Uh, but now, I mean, you don't get many moments like this. As I said, you don't get many moments like that. It's absolutely incredible. Let's make our way back, see how long it takes. Catch up the car. Insanely good. This view is so good. I'm going to show you where the, the scrub <laughs> is almost as tall as me. Just give me a second, be back. There's shit in the bushes as well. I just don't think about that. Oh, fucking the track past my waist, almost up to my head. It's insane. If you're gonna come out here, I would recommend wearing long pants. Unlike me, you. Let's go. These are the only tags in here, so they are few and far between. And they can be challenging to see when you're looking down at the ground. So make sure you pay extra attention. Make sure you double check where your markers are. Because as I said earlier, extremely disorientating in here because of the overgrown vegetation. Um, and you wouldn't want to get lost up here. It'd be terrifying. All right. Bye. Just got out. It's 10, 10 a.m. So what's that? I'm sorry, I'm puffed as. About an hour, 55, from Devil's Farm back to the creek. I'm gonna leave it there. I am gonna go jump in that water cause I am dripping wet. Catch you at the next one. <laughs>